Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Nancy, and if you've been here before, thanks for coming back. If this is your first time, welcome. Today, I'm skipping beauty-related stuff. My channel isn't always beauty-related. I like to sprinkle other things throughout my channel here and there, but I did get some Magic Mail, which is in this plain white box. It is from a company called I'm a Little Something. They're based out of Hawaii, and I will list all their information down below so you can check them out, see what they're about, get to know them, see what their products and their processes are. I don't want to botch anything, so I am not going to even try. But basically, their claim to fame were doing these little um, watch covers, these Disney-inspired watch covers that go over Apple watches. Unfortunately, for all of us Fitbit wearers like myself, they don't do covers for that at this time. So if you have an Apple Watch, I would definitely check them out. I'm gonna go ahead and put a picture up for you to take a peek at the kind of things that they do create. And they are amazing. If you're a Disney fan, this is definitely a little bit of an investment, but like most fans and finding something unique is kind of far and few between. You can pretty much buy Disney stuff everywhere and it's really easy to just kind of feel unoriginal when you're buying Disney items, you know, produced by Disney. So I really look forward to finding things from uh, individual sellers, Etsy sellers, small businesses, because there's just a little bit of a twist. It's not as common and it's a whole lot of fun to find. So let's, let's just go ahead and open this up. I'm sure from the thumbnail, hopefully I posted something fun for you guys to look at. Let's get to this super fun item. I am taking it out of the box. I'm super excited. Let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and put that information up for you. I don't know if you can read any of it. Looks a little blurry, doesn't it? But it's I'm a Little Something is the name of the company. Okay, so let's get into this super freaking awesome soap dispenser. Can you handle it? Okay, now you're like, mm, okay, it's a soap dispenser with this really big pump and it's got, you know, okay, it's got a little Mickey emblem on it. Like, what's the big deal? And I'm going to share with you why this is a big deal. So it comes with its own little uh, plastic bottle if you have your own soaps and suds or if you like buy in bulk i have no idea but you want to use the foaming hand wash you don't want to use traditional hand wash okay so none of that traditional liquid stuff foaming hand wash only okay so instructions add your choice of foaming soap to the bottle provided pump until it is primed place one hand under the dispenser guide so that it touches both arms Press pump down while keeping your hand touching the guide. Your hand should move down and up with the pump. Admire your cute bubbles. So basically what they're saying is you want to keep your hand like this and you don't want to just, uh, you know, do the pump from here and just squish it down. You want to go with the pump. Make sense? Okay, so you're supposed to put the bubbles in here. I have heard report that you can place it atop the um, the Bath and Body Works foaming bubble thingies. I heard it works. I don't know for a fact. I haven't seen it in action, so I'm going to give this a try. I heard they were compatible, so let's see. Oh, I forgot to bring a towel. Awesome. We're gonna wing it. Okay. So let me just go ahead and put that in there. Okay, so the first thing to make note of is it looks like the pump fits, but look at where the, um, the tube stops. So you can put it in your existing pump, but it's not gonna get all the way to the bottom. You just screw on, yeah, okay. So it looks like it does screw on, but okay. So we're gonna, wait, wait, okay. So now it is in the open position, priming it. Okay. Okay, it is primed, and now I really need a towel. 
Okay, the pump is primed. And these are the guides right here on the side. So the hand has to be touching it the whole time. So we're gonna go down. shape of Mickey. I am wasting soap and I'm not washing my hands but I want to show you again. Okay so let's do this one more time. The hand stays touching and boom. Mickey. Okay I will put my super annoying cute voice away because I'm driving myself nuts but can you believe it? Let's do this one more time. Boom. Dun, 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 dun. I love it. I absolutely love it. So let me just, let me do the other hand. <laughs> Boom. That one looks a little weird, but you get the point. It's Mickey Mouse soap. Now, is this necessary in my life? Probably not. But does it bring me joy? It certainly does. So therefore, it is totally worth it. Now, speaking of worth it, let me just tell you how much this cost. It was $24 plus shipping. I picked the black, classic black, because you can't go wrong, and I didn't want to commit to a color, like what if I changed the towels in my bathroom, or what if I painted my bathroom, or just... I just wanted something that was gonna go with everything. So I chose classic Mickey Black, you can't go wrong, but I think there were something like 12, 15, 16 different colors. There were a lot like teal, gold, silver, blue, red, yellow, you name it, she had it, purple, orange, the whole rainbow, and then some. So there were a variety of colors to choose from, but here's the trick. She has a website, yes. However, 3D printing, I don't know if you've bought from 3D printing vendors before, things take a little bit of time. It does take time to produce this stuff. So what she does is she creates enough stock to anticipate a sale. Once she has enough stuff ready to go, she will kind of give you a, she'll give you, she won't kind of, she will give you a heads up. And so I suggest if you're interested in something like this, that you sign up um, to follow her on Instagram or visit her website and sign up for the newsletter because she will keep you posted on when these are going to be up for purchase. So if you visit her website now, you're not going to be able to see them on there. That's just not how she runs things. If she does have enough to be sold. She'll kind of put like a pre-listing on there so that you can at least look at the colors and then she'll take that down and then once like the sale goes live for you to actually purchase, she will put everything up and trust me, these things fly off the shelves. I'm not even joking. I tried for two different sales to purchase this. Two different ones, two different postings. If you do want one of these, it's no joke. Be prepared, be ready to purchase. The fastest way to purchase is to have your PayPal account set up. I believe, I believe I paid through PayPal. It was the easiest thing. So if you don't do PayPal, you can do another method, but it takes a little bit longer. And having this in your shopping cart does not guarantee that like, that's not your placeholder, that's not yours. So you wanna be like ready to like put it in your cart and press purchase. So that's one thing to be aware of. And I think I got on the site within like, I think I got on and got my purchase within like four minutes. So it's no joke. Don't dilly dally. If you want it, be vigilant and just keep following her. She is only one person. She does as many orders as she can. She also does the Apple watch covers. It's super cute. I don't have kids. This is just for the kid in me. But if you do have kids or know somebody that has kids that loves Disney, or if you want to start creating like a good hand washing habit with little kids, I think this is enough to like kind of get that started. Definitely a good habit builder when something this cute is on your bathroom sink. So inevitably you will just end up transferring to this bottle, but you can 
use it in this one, but it comes with it regardless of whether you want the pump or the bottle, it's a package deal. So you will get the, um, you'll get the container and the pump together. You can't just choose to get the pump. So just so you know about that. And I do hope you enjoyed this little special edition of some magic mail. If you have questions or comments, please leave them down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you found this useful or helpful, or if you're just excited that I shared this cool little find with you. That's gonna do it, I'm gonna go now. Um, have a good day or good night wherever you are and take care until I see you around here next time. Okay, thanks, bye.